Ooh, that's a long that time a long in space. Time. And speaking of space, a new moon update here on Earth. Yeah, meteorologist Chan Wilhite joins us this morning to explain that it's only temporary, it sounds like, Halen. Yeah, I mean, you hear the phrase, oh yeah, we have another mini moon. You're like, wait, what? There's no way. Well, it's just a fun name to put on it. We have an asteroid that is going to be orbiting the Earth over the next two months, and so we'll call it a second mini moon just for fun. But we know the moon it orbits around the Earth in about 27 day periods, but uh, we have a newcomer. This little asteroid is going to be rotating around uh, at least both the Earth and the moon uh, over the two months uh, span, and this is not going to be causing any issues for us or really change anything for us uh, at all. Not going to be expecting this to get anything close to the Earth, so it's just going to stay just outside of our gravitational field, but uh, it's still going to be lasting all the way through the end of November, but it's about 33 feet wide. That's about the size of a school bus. You think, yeah, that's pretty big, but another and when you're talking about space, it's uh, pretty small, and that's why this is not going to be a threat to us or to the moon. And uh, one thing you're not going to be able to do with this is that you're not going to be able to see it through the naked eye or with just amateur uh, telescopes or binoculars. You need something high tech and uh, very powerful to be able to see this uh, second moon. But it's just something interesting that is going on. Uh, again, these things don't happen very often, but it certainly is something cool to see. And again, just to be able to call it a second mini moon uh, for the time being is also pretty cool.